This next story that I'm going to talk about takes us back to 2013 with a very interesting story for Lutheran Social Services of Michigan. Stay tuned after this. Hi, I'm Paul Schmidt, the owner and creative video strategist for Introduce Multimedia. And this time around, I want to talk about uh, a video we produced for Lutheran Social Services of Michigan. Now it's called Samaritas. They changed their name in that, in that time frame, but 2013 we were still working uh, hand in hand with producing the videos for this agency. And this time around they wanted us to do a video about the refugee services and they wanted to focus on the Grand Rapids office. When I went there, there was a plan. However, when I got there to Grand Rapids, the people that they anticipated uh, being there as the interview subjects hadn't arrived yet. And so they were a little put off a bit for that. But at the same time, they're like, well, we can start with uh, shooting the B-roll or the footage up for the video in a couple of these areas and then while we wait for our interview subjects to, to come, to get here. I was like, that's fine, which is typical. It's just a typical moment, you know, sometimes timing uh, doesn't really mesh. So in the midst of that, I'm, I'm shooting the footage to help illustrate parts of the video. And my contact came back in and she said, uh, I don't know if we're going to be able to do the interviews for the simple fact that we're having a hard time connecting with the interviews. We know they're in the area, but we don't know where they are. And I thought to myself, well, I'm here. And it's not like I'm going anywhere. So I just waited and we, we actually went another another spot. The, the client from the, the headquarters, because I was in their Grand Rapids office, their main headquarters is based in Detroit, and he called and said, what's going on? How are things going? I hear there's a little bit of a snag. I said, yeah, um, we're just catching some footage and we'll just figure out how this is going to play out the rest of the day. So he's like, well, just keep me posted. I said, sure. Um, in the midst of that conversation I was having with the client, my contact there said, we have something interesting. I'm like, okay. She's like, we have a family that is arriving right now from Kenya. They're coming to the airport. They're going to be there in about an hour. And I'm like, this is incredible. So we're actually going to capture the essence of what this agency does in the moment. And that was one of the most incredible things I think that I've ever been a part of um, doing this company is to see this moment that you can't capture at any other time of a family who's been completely transplanted from Africa to North America, catching that journey at the, on the last leg. Um, I was able to do a quick interview with their transition specialist at the, at the airport just off the cuff and she was very gracious to be able to do that interview and then I was able to follow up that interview later on with the uh, director of the agency. But having the family uh, welcome me as part of this group that welcomed them to this, to this uh, new life and new place in North America and and then also allowing me to come back after they settled in, we caught footage of them um, settling in and moving into their house, and um, but ha allowing me to come back later so that they can talk about their journey. And it was just an incredible moment of having, being there, it just seemed like it was the right place at the right time to, to see that 
and, and document that whole story of their journey and how the organization that I was, I was working with being able to do what they do best and, and that was like unforgettable. It was just a moment that I'll never forget. It was unforgettable. That's all, that's it with that. So thank you for staying with me for this story. Don't forget to check out all the other stories that we have going on um, as we go through our 20th year. Um, thank you for joining us on the journey. Don't forget to subscribe to the email list so you don't miss any. Or if you don't like to grab, get emails, you can always subscribe to us uh, on our you. You can always subscribe to us on our YouTube channel. I know I'd get through it at some point. Thanks for stopping by. See you next time.